My name is Megan Cooley and I live in Lancaster, Wisconsin. I've always been interested in teaching and serving others and so when I went to college I knew I wanted to be in some kind of a human services field. I toyed between nursing and teaching which are very much alike pouring yourselves into other people and settled on teaching until now <laughs> when I added nursing. I started in elementary education in a general ed classroom. I taught kindergarten, I taught fourth grade, I taught science and social studies as a specials class and then moved to Lancaster where I spent five years in third grade in a general ed classroom where I met so many students that inspired me that I wanted to do more for their education. I love teaching in general, but there were times when I felt my hands were tied as the gen ed teacher. I couldn't spend extra time just with those students struggling. I couldn't spend the extra hours outside of school when I also had lessons to prepare for all the students. So I started to think about special education and um, ended up becoming an early childhood teacher. Loved my time in early childhood and decided to move to the high school two years ago um, to reach students that I had already had once in third grade again. And it's been the perfect fit. I absolutely love my job and I love coming to school every day, helping students find their place in the world. Find that niche where they feel accepted and loved and cared for is so important to me. I feel like I'm making such a deep impact by preparing young adults for the rest of their lives. We have students ranging anywhere from needing a little extra help or some quiet time as they take tests to intellectual disabilities and we help every single student find a good fit job and community activities and to really have an authentic life outside of high school. We have a lot of students who have some health concerns and sometimes I felt that I didn't have enough background to be able to um, care for them. You know, our nurse is wonderful and she's here every single day to help us with those things, but it just made me feel better to achieve my CNA, to be able to provide better care. Additionally, it has helped me so much in providing care for all students. Uh, I had a conversation with a student one day. She said, I'd like to work at a nursing home. And I said, all right, what would you like to do? Well, all I can do is whatever entry level they have. I, I can't go to college, I can't do that. It's way too much information. I will never be able to get through it. And not only did I encourage her that of course she can do it and I'll be right there, but I started to feel a little bit of frustration that I, I don't know how to get these kids what they need in a CNA program and what an amazing job that that could be for a student who at one time thought only an entry level position with, with no experience, no education was what they could achieve and get them to a point where they're getting to care for others and serve others. So many students in transition services or special education have more empathy because they've required extra care, whether that be medically or academically or anything else. And they're such good caregivers and and servants to others and so I started to feel this frustration of how can I help. I was applying the knowledge to the next day's care for students. I was thinking of all the different things I could make and how I could break down activities and maybe I could take pictures of the different range of motion. Maybe I could have all of my students in life skills science you know, practice the different range of motion or some of the vocabulary terms. So my mind would just be racing. Watching some of my students achieve their CNA has been amazing. Watching other students who have always kind of written themselves off or thought they couldn't are now thinking they might and they can. Just take the step, whether it's doing some professional development on your own, you know, doing things in the name of students and serving others not only gives us all more knowledge, but it connects us, it develops deeper relationships and more trust, and in turn, makes student experience better and 
sometimes even makes my job easier because they want to work, they want to do well. So my biggest piece of advice is just take that step. Take the step to serve others in the name of students.